what's up guys welcome back to my channel i'm here y'all i'm back y'all it's been three months i know i didn't even realize it had been that long i didn't even realize it had been three months until uh i got like a reach out from a brand and they were like uh yeah such and such and such it's been three months i was like oh okay yeah so and get some content up here for you guys because i love you guys if you are new to my channel welcome 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 my name is Shantae I post videos about fashion beauty lifestyle and anything I feel like talking about at the moment and child that could be anything don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe and hit that bell so you can be informed of all of my upcoming videos and yes there will be upcoming videos in today's video we are talking fall fashion trends and what is worth buying into I'm gonna share five of the ones that I picked Scour the internet, guys. There's so much information that it just makes you want to just stay home, okay? <laughs> it's so much information. And I was like, you know, I can only imagine how it feels if you're really not a fashion person and you don't really, like, keep up with stuff and keep up with trends and, like, you know, you're looking to someone for, like, some sort of a cheat code or guidelines or, you know, something to simplify it because it's a lot of information it's so confusing and if you are just not in fashion it just really makes you want to just forget it and say whatever i'm just gonna wear some sweatpants <laughs> trends are always changing guys like there's trends here tomorrow yesterday last week the word trend really confuses people and it really overwhelms people <laughs> but i'm here to help you simplify that and make your life easier make getting dressed fun because look it should be fun getting dressed is supposed to be fun you wear what makes you feel good wear what you love and don't worry about what anybody else has to say the way trends work the high-end fashion houses pretty much set the trends and whatever they put in their shows during the fashion weeks for autumn and winter or spring and summer those are what trickles down into you know the department stores and then down into the stores that are like you know the stores that most you know everybody goes into that's why you always see things repeating itself because fashion is a cycle so with trends the word trend is just saying that this particular look this particular style this particular item is current as of this season as of the 2024 2025 fashion season that's what the trends are it's not that um it's something new if that makes sense sometimes trends are fleeting they will come and be gone in three months six months and you will never see it again but sometimes trends are just things that are something that you probably have in your closet something that you probably wear every single day but it's popping again okay so we got that out the way <laughs> i've chosen five of the things that are currently trending for the fall season that I feel are practical and have a practical element, a practical use, something that I know that you may, like I said, and I might say this a lot in this video, you have these items in your closet or something pertaining to this particular trend in your closet, okay? The other thing about a trend is when something is trending, you'll have an easier time finding in the store. That's the key. That's a key part to this. So my first one that I say is a fall trend that is worth buying into is animal print or leopard print. So I just, I guess I should just say animal print. Y'all, animal print has never gone anywhere. Animal print is not, it's not dead. It's not obsolete, right? Animal print is a neutral, okay? I don't care what anybody says. <laughs> a bold, fun, print that is um such a great addition to your wardrobe you will probably be able to find a lot of pieces with using a lot of animal prints shoes um coats like i saw some trench coats in full animal print pants and animal print leopard print so leopard print is absolutely a trend that is worth buying into remember what i said trend just means that it has had a resurgence and it's being used by a lot of the designers, which makes it more readily available to the consumer in the store. I, I feel like animal print works best in accessories. That's just my opinion. For instance, I have these Steve Madden shoes that I've had for years, okay? When I say years, and I mean years, they are like this open-toed, block-heeled, 
um, strappy sandal, right? These animal print or leopard print heels that I've had for, I know it's more than 10 years, y'all. Do not judge me. <laughs> um, and they haven't really been worn a lot because like I said, these are, this is, this is, has to be thought out. You know what I'm saying? You don't just throw these on every day. And then that heel is really high. But yes, these that Steve Madden um, strappy sandals with the block heel. Leopard print. I love these. I used to have a pair of Steve Madden pumps that were just like this with the faux, with the fur. Um, and I got rid of them because they were so uncomfortable. Be particular about what you choose. Think more accessories because um, that is something that you can style with many different outfits you might limit yourself if you do something really really particular like a sweater or pants but like if you think like shoes or like something like a bag or something that will keep you in a line of having something or of having the piece even though it might not be trending in a year it'll still be something that'll be in style next thing that is trending right now is the boho chic or boho style now sometimes it's an item sometimes it's an idea okay so like the idea of a boho chic look or a boho look so boho is basically like flowy full um you know like the billowing dresses and oversized shirts and free people is a perfect example of boho boho chic styles really big bags are having a resurgence um in the boho um vein um those really chunky oversized hobo bags are really having a resurgence right now even those jumpsuits the really big billowy flowy jumpsuits that is right along the lines of boho so that's another trend that is definitely worth buying into a good example of like a boho chic feel and this is actually more than one trend at happening at a time because the really big prints is having a resurgence this blouse is very flowy very um full the, the, the fabric is very lightweight and I've had this for a while. I got this from Zara uh, several years ago. And some pieces you buy and you might not wear them all the time, but it's like, you know, not to get rid of it because you're like, oh, I'm going to wear that at some point or that's going to be popular again. And um, sometimes that happens, you know what I'm saying? You have stuff in your closet that you're just like, even though I don't wear it every day, I know that it's not out of style. I know that it's not something that I should just get rid of this next trend is full skirts are having a resurgence of a moment just like those really big full a-line skirts um that really fit and complement every body type super feminine so much fun i recently purchased this particular skirt this is by the brand gracia i got this from um what is it the bloomingdale's outlet store in Potomac Mills. This skirt caught my eye <laughs> and I've wanted a tulle skirt for years, right? Like I have wanted one for so long, but I never really just found one that I wanted to drop, drop a penny on or, you know, really invest in. But when I saw these little rosettes on here, guys, Look at the detail, the quality of the tool is so thick and full. You have like um, like A-line, full A-line skirts. They are really, really having a comeback right now and they're really popular. So finding something like that for work or for church or for a wedding is gonna be so fun. Another thing that is having a trending and a resurgence right now is denim on denim. And here we go with another idea, right? Like. The idea of denim on denim, that's another thing that is never really going to go out of style, right? Wearing a denim shirt with some denim pants. You can't, that is a classic outfit. That is a classic look. You can wear that in 30 years and look stylish and put together. That's one of my favorite outfits of all time, okay? It is easy. It is effortless. And now with it trending, you can probably find a denim blazer. You could probably find a pantsuit this denim bags denim and I feel like this particular trend is something that sometimes trends can last for a year for a couple years you know what I'm saying like you'll see it um on the runway and then still two years later it'll be like something that's really still popular and still be a lot of that in the store be excited because I'm telling you we're shopping our closets for fall okay we're shopping our clothes pull out the animal print pull out the denim 
jeans and shirts and if you have an old denim purse that you just sat and have sitting in your closet and you're just like I don't know if I pull it a girl pull it out okay it's popping it's trending there you go and the last fall trend worth buying into are barrel pants slash jeans oh my god <laughs> these are that girl right now okay barrel jeans barrel pants are that girl right now barrel pants or jeans are a slightly oversized jean that is tapered along the ankle a fun modern take on mom jeans it just takes it it's just it's just a great i don't know who did this i don't know who sat in a room and designed this i would just love to see their sketchbook somebody was just like i'm really bored with just a typical straight leg so let me just pull that leg out just a little bit it's just the best thing and barrel jeans barrel pants they just look so modern so they're so fun they're so on trend like if you want to be an it girl if you want to be a fashion girly if you want to look like she knows what she's doing when you come out of your house girl get you a pair of bare like you can there are so many barrel leg jeans on amazon like for real like there are so you can find so many like you got to be really careful and pick good quality good ratings or whatever but child and i found the most amazing mouth watering pair from maywell when i tell y'all about these jeans child and i have been looking for a pair of barrel jeans barrel leg jeans and um the ones that i was looking at were like 200 250 dollars i was like yeah no um but when these made well ones popped up this seam that goes down the leg in the back and then they have these gather seams in the like right around the knee and they just fit so well I need to get mine taken in to be honest like the sizing is kind of weird um but i love them still and we're gonna cinch the waist in these things until we get them taken in but yes these are my fine may well i think they are still available but they were selling out pretty quickly which is why i hopped on one and i actually had to take the pair that i bought back because they were too big and i had to go down about three sizes because i I usually buy jeans a little bit bigger because, you know, I have a beautiful midsection that never wants to leave me. But yeah, barrel leg jeans, guys, those that tapered leg. And it's fun. It does this thing with your body like your silhouette. It it brings you in. Um, the tapering gives you this slimming effect. And it's just such a fun fun take on jeans it's just a fun like if you're you know if you have a lot of jeans and you're looking for something different barrel leg jeans are the way to go like obsessed is not even the word that i could use to talk about barrel leg jeans so definitely a trend worth buying into and they've been trending for i, I think about a year and a half i keep seeing it and i I, honest to God, guys, I don't necessarily feel like it's going anywhere because that, that cut, that style is just so cool. It's just the coolest cut. If somebody does something and they're just like, we don't like that anymore, we're just going to go back to straight leg. Straight leg might be trending next year, but I don't think you would have to get rid of the barrel leg jeans. And the reason why I say, is it worth buying into is because you're going to spend your hard earned coin and you need to know if it's like worth the investment. You know what I'm saying? We don't throw money away around here. We don't we don't spend money on things we're not going to wear. We don't waste. We don't you know, what I'm saying? we don't do that. We want cost per wear. We want it to make sense. We want it to be practical. We want it to be usable. Something that I reach for all the time. There is nothing worse than spending $150 on a blazer or a dress or a pair of shoes or a pair of jeans that you never wear. There's the that's the worst feeling. It's a frustrating feeling. And if you don't know how to wear, you know what I'm saying? So this whole video, the point of this video is to make sure that you are getting your money's worth. So the barrel leg though, definitely worth it. Definitely worth it. And I, I actually, now that I have a pair of jeans that are like that, I, I actually feel like I want to get like some slacks or like a, pa a pantsuit, y'all. So there you have it, people. Five fall trends, definitely worth buying into, definitely worth um, looking into you know adding a piece to your collection somewhere along the lines or going and shopping your closet and seeing that you already have it because <laughs>
because you probably have four out of the five things that I have listed. Animal print, of course you have that. I think, who doesn't have an animal? If you don't have animal print, anything, maybe you just have a scarf, right? You got some animal print in your closet, I promise you. And you know denim on denim. We don't even have to talk about that. Okay. If you want to see my video on five outfits to wear when you have nothing to wear, that is one of the outfits. Okay, the denim on denim, denim shirt, denim jeans, like with some red pump. Y'all know, y'all know. Share this video with a friend. If you have somebody that is so frustrated with their closet or frustrated with their fashion, doesn't know what to wear every day, and they're just like, trends, what is a trend? What is this? What is that? This is a perfect video for somebody like that because look, we're all about practicality around here. Like I'm, I'm not gonna do this other stuff. Practical everyday outfits for me. This is what we do. This is who we are because 99% of the time, you're not going to fashion week, you know? <laughs> the everyday person just needs to know what to wear to work every day or to know what to go to the grocery store or to their date night with their or girls night. Like, you know what I'm saying? Practicality is the word of the day. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to leave a like and comment below. Subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be informed whenever I post a new video. And you definitely want to be notified because I have some fun things that I'm working on. And I love you guys so much. I will see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.